I'm Rebecca Day and I work for the Scottish Documentary Institute. Um, we're a production company and a training organisation based in Edinburgh and we have a strong focus on creative documentary that is made for the cinema. We run a training programme called Bridging the Gap for first time filmmakers making their first professional short film. Um, it's a 10 minute long, 10 minute long films. So we commission four filmmakers a year and then we distribute them to festivals around the world. And then with the production company we make um, short films and half hours for television and feature length documentaries. So my role within the company, within Scottish Documentary Institute, is as a producer and a production manager. So um, I've listened, I have pitched and have listened to lots of pitches in my, in my, uh, in the past few years. So I was here today to listen to pitches from new filmmakers and I was very impressed. I was very impressed with the quality of the pitching. I think a lot of the projects um, were in very early development phase and that's a really good time for filmmakers to go through this process where, you know, they're not necessarily trying to get a commission so the stakes aren't as high, but they're learning how, they're learning the process of developing a project, receiving criticism, receiving praise, how to go through that process of chucking all out and bringing it all back together again and um, getting ready to go to market. I'm a very nervous pitcher, so I'm probably not the best person to ask, but I think making direct eye contact with the person that you're pitching to, knowing your story inside out, really don't pitch until you're ready. And especially now, it's getting so much more competitive. So I would say, you know, know your characters, know your access, know your narrative arc. The narrative arc is something that's left out of a pitch so often. Your commissioners are going to want to know what's going to happen at the end of your documentary, even though it's documentary. So have something to say that, you know, where your story is leading. Lots of practice, lots of research. Um, don't don't try and run before you can walk. I think try on practice on small short form films. Practice your technique, your ability to to talk to characters and pull the most out of them that you can, and and how to assess your own work. I think is really important. So doing these doing these workshops, sharing your work with other people, getting feedback on that. It's it's all part of the process. And then learning to work creatively as part of a team. It doesn't have to be a solitary process. It's really important to be able to get, you know, to work with a producer, to work with a cameraman, a sound recordist, all those things is good training. <laughs>